ocean of fans descending upon the stadium for what promises to be an absolutely riveting FA Cup final. We'll have every kick of the ball for you live on EA TV. At long last, the wait is over. A warm welcome to Wembley. This is Derek Ray, joined in the commentary box by Stuart Robson. And we're approaching kickoff time in what promises to be a spectacular FA Cup final. It is Liverpool, and they face Hull City. Well, Derek, as a youngster growing up, this was the day that every young footballer dreamt of. Playing in the FA Cup final, walking out in front of 100,000 fans at Wembley, broadcast around the world, it still brings a tingle to my spine. And I'm really looking forward to this one. Now can they make something happen? Oscar Estupiñán. Looking away patiently, looking for an opening. He'll be breathing a sigh of relief. Ball one. So the starting lineup for Liverpool. Alisson begins in goal. Trent Alexander Arnold plays with Andrew Robertson in the wide defensive areas. Thiago starts alongside Fabinho in the centre of midfield. And rather than use a strike partnership, they've gone with just the one player in attack. Oh, a goal for Liverpool! The first goal of this final. And how important could that be? Well, it's great awareness of space in the box and then he shows a lot of composure with the finish. That's a clever goal. Elliot. Now he must favour the cross. Fantastic work to thwart the danger. Ozan Tufan. Good technique displayed. And intercepted it. Could pick out a teammate. A Liverpool free kick coming up. Nunez. Can he finish? A oh, really sound goalkeeping. Well, that's such a good save, isn't it? How did he keep that one out? And over comes the corner. Well, thumped clear. Robertson. On to Salah. Really vital interception here. Can they hit on the break? Oscar Estupiñán. Dimitrios Pelkas. Well, visionary passing. And nothing positive comes of it, unfortunately. Well, Liverpool haven't dominated possession, as you can see, but their counter-attacking has been really good, particularly in the wide areas. It's been an excellent performance from them so far. Nicely timed tackle.
Ozan Tufan. Pelkas. Slater. Take some progress with the ball at his feet. A good and fair challenge. And getting close to half time with Liverpool in front here. Stuart, what strikes you about what you've seen from them in the first half? Well, they've worked hard and played well to be in front here, but they now need to keep their focus as we approach half time. Well, in terms of added time, a minimum of one minute. Ozan Tufan. And there it is, the half-time whistle. Well, underway again. Advantage Liverpool after the first 45, but a long way from being settled. Making use of his physical strength to hang on to it. Can he take advantage? And missing the chance to give them a bit of breathing space. Well, that should have made it more comfortable, shouldn't it? But it's a wasted opportunity. Here it is now, a substitution. It is a decent looking attack here. He has time to play it over. Opportunity here. And a goal! I'll tell you what, they're going to be very hard to catch now. Name on the trophy, maybe. Well, here's the replay, and you see it was a good finish. But the keeper at his near post has to do a lot better. He's got to have that near post covered for me. So underway once more, 2-0 the lead here. Ozan Tufan. Figueiredo. Greaves. Seri. Tete. And return to Seri. Really sound goalkeeping. Well, that had to be a goal, didn't it? What a stop that is. Well, they have elected to go to the bench at this stage of the game. And taken short. And a very good challenge. Alexander Arnold. And a creative look about this. But the danger averted for now. Chance to reduce the arrears. And a goal! Not over just yet. Well, here it is again, and it's all about the pace on the counter-attack. They were so quick to break out from their defensive positions, and from there, he never looked like missing. That's a lovely goal. Well, underway again, it's a narrow 2-1 lead as things stand.
Andrew Robertson. Liverpool in a position of menace. Surely! Oh, it's in! A two-goal cushion now, and the lead fully merited. Well, here it is, 1v1 against the keeper, and the outcome was never really in doubt. He never looked like missing that. Well, the action continues, and no shortage of goals. 3-1 as things stand. Estupinian. Just 15 minutes remaining. Plenty of options. No possibilities inside the box. A very timely interception. Fabinho. Very quick thinking there. It is advantage Liverpool here. He's protecting it well. Well, as we get close to full time, no two ways about it, Stuart. Liverpool bossing this one. Yeah, this has been a good performance. They've looked really sharp going forward and they've shown a lot of energy. They'll certainly be pleased with their overall display up to now. Interception to snuff out the danger. Andrew Robertson. Here is Thiago. Nice switch of play. Fabinho. And he did well to cut it out. Well, three minutes of stoppage time, that's what the officials have said. And intercepts again. And there goes the final whistle. The cup issue is settled. A story of one side celebrating and the other distraught. Memories are being made. Well, just look at those scenes down there, Derek. What a contrast in emotions. Brilliant for the winners, despair for the losers. But overall, the right team won today. Yeah, you can see what it means to this tight-knit team. Real solidarity. Well, this is special for everybody at the club. What a great moment for any young player. And this is what you dream about when you start playing football. When you're playing in the playground, you want to win a cup. Brilliant moment. Yes, a special moment in the career of any footballer. And now for the trophy lift itself. The cup winners. Well, you can just see what it means to those players and the manager. That's fantastic stuff. There's always the element of chance in a cup competition. But my goodness, they've taken the rough with the smooth. And now they savour the moment. Four marks to the entire team, and now they get the chance to exhale and enjoy. They've been brilliant in this competition, and so have the fans. They've really got behind their team. They've played a big part in this win. Just look at those faces in the crowd. Great stuff. They're really a match made in heaven between players and fans. And these celebrations are going to continue for quite some time. Now the players get to relax a bit and enjoy having the pictures taken. Well, these photos will be cherished for years to come, won't they? Certainly ones to show the grandchildren.